So if you go down, you have your advanced stats, your heart rate, your resting, your sleep score, your SpO2, and then your exercise workouts for the week. Here you can also cycle through that stuff very quickly. Fuel points, miles, date. You can see your timers. You can quickly set one. Here you have your alarm. You can turn that on or off. And then you can even turn smart wake, which will do a 30 minute increment. Then you can do a relaxed session. Then you can do your exercises, run, bike, swim, workout, treadmill. You can do them in the Fitbit mobile app. Notifications, I have nothing to read here. Then up here, you can have your auto wake. I like to keep it on, so when I flick it up, it'll show me. Do not disturb. And then your sleep mode, find phone, which will ping your phone. One on wrist, you can change it to clip on body. And then your water lock. And in your settings, you have display settings, which are normal, max, dim, out of wake, screen timeout. You can do medium, long, or default, and then always on battery. And that's pretty much it. If you're in the menu, you can always hit this to go back. And if you hit it again, it'll turn off. If you hit it again, it'll go on.